Whether you're struggling with your aim or improving it, this 2025 Rock Cell tutorial is going to take you step by step on the ins and outs of what you got to do to make your aim insane using Rock Cell. For the settings, you're going to want to go to mouse settings, um, and then you're going to go additional mouse options, and then pointer options, and enhance pointer precision off. I want to do I'm gonna go to properties then you're gonna go to compatibility and then change high DPI settings and then you're gonna put override high scaling DPI performed by application essentially the only Valorant setting that you have to change is the raw input buffer always switch this to on when you're using raw so second thing you're gonna want to do is look up raw so it's gonna be the first one github and then uh, just click that and then you're gonna want to click on it and bring this over to my main monitor here so rock cell, you're gonna wanna extract this. One second here. You gotta extract all first, extract, extract, and then it'll bring you to the actual one, and then you just open it up. All right, currently this is what my rock cell curve is looking like, but if you guys wanna change yours up for this, um, my current DPI is 800. I would like a 1600 fill, and then my in-game sense is 0.3. And then, so for the low sense, what you're gonna wanna do, you wanna do 0.3, and then divide your sense by two, whatever your sense is, divide it by two. All right, so 0.15 is gonna be for the low sense. And then for the high sense, you wanna multiply it by three. So 0.3 times three, holy shit, I just did math wrong. 0.3 times three equals 0.9. Have two EDPIs and you're watching this video, you're already cooked. I usually put the sense multiplier at two. And then we're gonna have I, I usually use classic, so you, you you'll use classic and then acceleration. I usually put mine at 0 0.03, and we do output, and then for the cap, do three, and then offset power. I usually don't leave it at zero, and then power, I usually put it at two. 0.5 so we'll just do that for now so that's kind of like what the curve would give me usually the raw excel curve helper would help me find and then you kind of just fine tune it from there so i kind of found the, the rough shape i want okay this whole video is gay i kind of found the rough curve i wanted we're going to play with it played with the curve all right and ready um let's say your low sense or whatever was like 0.2 and then you'll play with 0.2 if you want a higher sense play with double that it's pretty self-explanatory so all right right now we're gonna hop into a game using raw excel I hey loki i left you guys on a cliffhanger but if you want to check out uh my new video should be out tomorrow on the raw excel and uh what it actually did in my games and how good i did and stuff so if you guys want to see that just uh just wait just wait a bit if you guys did make it to the end of the video though and it helped you at all, please sub up. It really helps me a lot and uh, that's about it. I'll catch y'all later.